Okay, what I'm doing now is this is a quick test run for Windows Media Encoder screen capture. And what I'm going to try and do is show you my 4x chart. So I'll close Media Player. Uh, that's Internet Explorer. This is FXCM. Uh, 4x Capital Markets Limited is a company that I trade with and they give offer a range of um, charts to trade with Th most of them are free and some of them are premium I pay a monthly premium to use the charts but this is the one I like because it's simple 4x Power Charts runs on Java sometimes when uh, Internet Explorer is started with a bug or a hang up it doesn't like won't open the window typically now when I'm doing my example you know, it doesn't make any difference because I'm testing Windows Media Encoder not the Internet Explorer so apparently when I open this window here which is the Media Encoder window it pauses the video capture which is rather anyway what I didn't realize was when I pause the video capturing with Windows Media Encoder it didn't pause it, it stopped it and I have to restart it again anyway we were looking at 4x charts, so let's go back over here power charts, I've already got the window open I was taking a quick look at the dollar, we've got euro, GBP, USD pound yen, dollar Canadian dollar, or the loony as they call it, USD JPY and USD Swissy. Let's have a look at the dollar. Just close media player. And I was just looking at the, the negative divergence between the daily chart uptrend around here and on the relative strength index indicator it's showing a downtrend <coughs> which sometimes can imply a trend reversal if we go with back to the hourly chart you know this is too slow for my liking so I'm going to pause it there can't show you things on the computer if the computer won't respond can I? Oh, here we go what I was going to say was the hourly relative strength index down here in the corner is very low which implies that it's going to bounce up again and also the candle is very near to a long term trend line and a short term up trend line which I'm going to watch to see if it either bounces off it or breaks through it and then trade accordingly so anyway that's my little video thanks for watching